So all you got to do is grab the receipt, click the camera button, hold it up to the camera, get a good focus, click take, if you're happy with the picture, click submit for processing. And then if you just watch, the blue line will appear across the app. Now this is as it's trying to load up. So what we want to do is we want to keep this app open until that blue line's completely up and we have a, and it says uploaded. And you'll notice that the color will change from gray to orange and it will say not ready for export. Okay, there you are. There we go. Now we know that's been uploaded because it's gone orange and it says not ready for export. So we can then just click on that and scroll down and we can see our United Fuel image. And if we're happy with that, we can just click save. Alternatively, one of the important things that we can do here, because it's a fuel docket, any of the fuel dockets, we always put in a registration number so that way we know what car this fuel was for. So I'll put my registration number in there. And then once I've done that, I'll click save. And what that's done is now that's, that's actually linked to this fuel account, what rego that's for. And that's very important for us for tax purposes that we get you to put your registration number in there quickly and click save. So, just a bit of navigation. If you click on the little cog symbol, this will take you to the accounts. And we've got one account listed there. If you want multiple accounts, so if you've got a few different businesses, you can add another account there. And then you can just select on the email between the two different accounts. So for example, I can add, you know, another receipt bank account to there without any worries. So for example, if I add that there, I just add another account. So Tony at I. And then now we've got two different accounts. I can use the either I Count Beans test or the Tony at I Count Beans. So that's two different businesses linked to two different receipt bank accounts. So when you're going to take the photo, you just select the account you want. For example, I Count Beans test, and then you click back to invoice, and then you can click the camera button to take the photo. So there you have it, guys. That's how you add a receipt bank app to the phone and how you add a picture. And we gave the example there of a fuel docket.